to happen. Oh, oh my. Oh, oh, I feel like, oh, what was her name? Um, in, in the space movie where they're floating? The George Clooney and. In the space movie where they're floating. Was that Sandra Bullock? Sandra Bullock. Okay. Thank you. Gravity. I, gravity. I, I, I feel like arguably okay. the worst scene in any of the Star Wars movies. When when General Leia Organa is is somehow magically surviving right. in the in the coldness of space without anything to protect her, but that's a whole different story Bob, for a different time. Bob, help me! I went okay. I went Sith with it, Jen. Oh, yep. Okay. Okay. I should probably read this. One. I'm definitely not grabbing onto something here with my hand that you can't see. <laughs> it's not, not me. That's either. not that's not what's happening here. <laughs> just so you, pillows, just so you, just. Okay. <laughs> May the fourth be with you. Mm. Started out as an online meme, but since then, the day has given Star Wars fans a reason to celebrate their favorite franchise. I'm, I'm clenching so much with some stuff right now. Uh, Local 12's Eddie Brown <laughs> takes us away, maybe not to a galaxy far, far away, but somewhere a little closer to find a Star Wars cantina. Hey, Annie! Hey, good morning. Well, I'd like to think I'm in a galaxy far, far away. Honestly, I would love to be in a galaxy far, far away, but I'm in the galactic cantina here and take a look around. It actually, I actually had to stop and look at all of the different decor all over the walls because it's all so, so cool. And it really reminds you of a Star Wars cantina. Now I'm here with Jacob Trevino. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Bright suns, as we say on the side of the galaxy. Yes, it's exactly. so good to have you guys here at the Galactic Cantina for its second year. I love it. Yes, getting ready to it. count down to May the 4th. May the 4th be with you. And then Revenge of the 5th. Of course. Uh, we can't forget Revenge of the 5th day, too. It, People forget that one. It's a real day. Come exactly. on. The prequels matter. They you do know? matter. Yes. I am a prequel stan. I'm just going to say that right now on TV. So, yeah. What do we got here? So we are here at the Galactic Cantina down here at Finley Market, back for its second year. Uh, this is our pop-up uh, bounty hunter bar in a galaxy far, far away. Uh, so you can come in, uh, refuel your ship, you know, repair your droid, and get any sort of libations. We have libations for all ages. Uh, so we are all ages until 9 p.m. And then after that, it gets a little dangerous around here. So it's just for adults after that. Uh, but we have things like our iconic, famous blue milk, our rowdy I rancor. Uh, yeah. yeah, we've got some new drinks this year on our menu, like our scruffy nerf herder, which is like a peanut butter cold brew. And so that one fun. sounds really good. I really want to try that one. <laughs> yeah, so if you're looking to celebrate May the 4th, come down here this Saturday. We're going to open at 1 p.m. We're here Thursday. Thursday through Sunday. Uh, we're open 1 p.m. until midnight. That's awesome. What is your favorite part? So you've been doing this for two years. What is the best part of doing this Star Wars themed pop up? Uh, I think it, uh, Star Wars really strikes a hero in us all, um, or maybe even the villain in us all. So I think it's a great way to kind of touch base with the kid in all of us and, and really uh, just celebrate something that, that makes us feel good, which is obviously Star Wars. I love it. Well, thank you so much. Hey, thanks for coming out. Yeah. I'm going to keep looking around in here because, honestly, I don't know if you've seen a smile this big on me for quite a while. So I'm going to send it back to you guys. Not know that Annie was such a she, big... She's big time. <laughs> she's, Annie, she's, you can't Annie, see us right now, but we're you. literally throwing, floating through space. And, so and much, to... much respect for her, her honesty about loving the prequels. Because right. not everybody's quite that bold. So you're ready for the fifth, right? Yes, Revenge that's why I got red. Cause yes, cause red is absolutely. Very, no, very silly. Whoop, no, definitely no. didn't hit that. Yep, nope, nope nothing back there but space. Hey, other people are going to be celebrating... May the 4th as well. <laughs> the Cincinnati Museum has a day of fun for the younglings. They have a busy schedule of events for May the 4th. My abs are so activated right now. Uh, right, okay. my thighs too. Uh, there are STEM activities for kids like a Death Star Stunt Spectacular featuring a liquid nitrogen explosion. Love it. And take a look at Cincinnati's connection to the Star Wars franchise through the Kenner Toys. Amazing. Events at the museum start at 1130 and run through 5. Super okay. cool. By the way, toys. let me just let me just mention one of the amazing things that's happening right yeah. now is not far from us in this location. There are people trying to do professional television things. Right, they're they're doing lighting or something over Correct. there. Correct. They're being great. And we're just floating we're just through, floating space. through space. space. And there's a little star right there. Oh, look! Oh, oh that's careful. We we'll just be be real cautious. <laughs> next you can see the first prequel movie. You can see the first prequel movie in theaters. AMC theaters will be showing Star Wars Episode I, The Phantom Menace, on the big screen this Friday. This year is the 25th anniversary, 25th anniversary of the film, I should say. Uh, the theater also going to be showing a special preview of the new series, The Acolyte, which I can't wait for. Uh, tickets are $9 for adults, 7 for kids. They also have a limited release of an R2-D2 popcorn bucket. Ooh. 
You know the the, the, popcorn, the, the popcorn bucket thing. Yeah. That's a new. That's a big. That is. That's it, a big it, thing it has, happening it's lately. Exploded lately with the coolness of the, the yeah. popcorn buckets. Yeah, I love the love the popcorn yeah. bucket thing. What is happening over there? <laughs> My gosh, they I feel found. Like I'm conducting they, a symphony and they, floating in space look, and doing the news. Somehow of the they put us on a giant monitor. <laughs> I don't know where that is. Perhaps it's somewhere in the Death Star. I know. Okay. Somewhere in space. Well, if for some reason oh. you need more Star Wars merch, okay, this is really cool. May, May the 4th is a great day to do some shopping. Uh, so, Bob? Yes, we wanted to take a look at some of the more unusual items on sale for Star Wars Day. The force is strong with this marriage. You could say, I do, with these Star Wars rings from the company Enso. You got a few options. There are designs for a Stormtrooper, Darth Vader, Mandalorian, Grogu, R2-D2, and C-3PO. And how about a matching set of PJs from Hannah Anderson? The clothing brand is offering 20% off all Star Wars apparel. They also have sets of Star Wars underwear in both boxers and briefs. That reminds me of, remember, underoos when we were kids? Love me some underoos. Yeah. And hey, you don't need the force. Oh, I want this. To find your bags at the airport, not with this one. No, that is the droid you're looking for. The luggage brand American Tourister is offering this R2-D2 suitcase. They also have a, uh, these are the droids you're looking for. Oh, luggage funny. tag. Yeah. Smart. And Smart. these are pretty cool. The brand Box Lunch has a graphic outerwear line. Bob, look. Look at the Star Wars jacket. There. Yeah. And those are so cool. And that sweater, that there's on sale right now, 25% off. And everyone's, well, you know, least favorite character is a Funko Pop. The Funko brand is offering a buy three, get one free of all Star Wars characters, including the uh, one and only uh, Jar Jar Binks. Misa so excited about the Funko Pop. Okay. But you know what's really funny is even when we haven't been on camera, yeah. we've, we've, still still been, been we've still been doing this. We've still been doing this. Seriously. I am so, there's, this has been amazing. Yeah, this, this is, is one of my it's favorite a, things. It's been a workout. I don't need to go we've to the ever, gym either. That's ever happened. Okay. Maybe for us. Yeah, maybe we should take a break. Gotta be careful with that lightsaber, just like that star. <laughs> you just gotta, you gotta watch out. <laughs> you, just, you gotta be careful. Okay. That's all. 826. Sure, you can stop watching, but let's be honest, you wanna know more. Tap the links, or even better, click subscribe to stay in the know.